Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a bold and aggressive move, Iran's Revolutionary Guard, IRGC, executed a direct air assault using a Russian-made Mi-17E helicopter on the MSC Ares, an Israeli container ship linked to London-based Zodiac Maritime. The operation, reported by the state-run Erna Iranian News Agency on April 13, 2024, was conducted by a special forces unit of the IRGC Navy, employing tactics reminiscent of similar commando raids on ships by both the Guard and Yemen's Houthis. This brazen action is part of a broader series of confrontational actions by Iran, which has been involved in numerous ship seizures and attacks on maritime vessels since 2019. These acts occur against a backdrop of escalating tensions with Western nations over Iran's rapidly advancing nuclear program. The recent air assault, coupled with an airstrike inside Israeli territory, starkly demonstrates Iran's intention to intensify direct confrontations with Israel. The IRGC, established in May 1979 by Ruhollah Khomeini after the Iranian Revolution, plays a central role in such operations. Structured as a multi-service branch of the Iranian Armed Forces, the IRGC encompasses ground forces, navy, air force, intelligence, and special forces units, enabling it to conduct a variety of military operations. Notably, its Quds Force specializes in extraterritorial operations, amplifying Iran's reach beyond its borders. Equipped with advanced weaponry and employing innovative tactics, the IRGC's combat capabilities are extensive. The utilization of Mi-17 helicopters for rapid deployment and surprise attacks underscores the strategic and operational depth of the IRGC, positioning it as a formidable force in Iran's military strategy against perceived adversaries. Recent conflicts, such as the war in Gaza and maritime attacks by Houthi rebels in Yemen, have exacerbated tensions in the Middle East, particularly between Iran and Israel. Iran's support for groups like Hamas and Hezbollah, coupled with its backing of Houthi rebels, underscores its substantial influence in the region and its potential to disrupt regional stability and Israeli security. The conflict in Gaza, characterized by intense exchanges of fire between Hamas and Israeli forces, has seen Iran provide significant support to Hamas, including financial aid, military training, and advanced weaponry. This support has bolstered Hamas's capabilities to launch rockets deeper into Israeli territory, exacerbating tensions and security concerns for Israel. Simultaneously, Houthi rebels in Yemen, backed by Iran, have escalated maritime attacks, targeting international shipping routes and posing a direct threat to international maritime security. Such actions reflect Iran's capacity to project power beyond its borders and demonstrate its influence over proxy groups operating in strategically critical areas. Iran's strategy of using proxy groups to challenge adversaries indirectly has raised alarms about broader implications for regional security. Direct and indirect actions by Iran, whether through military confrontations or support for allied groups, signal a heightened state of readiness and willingness to confront adversaries more openly, deepening the security dilemma in the Middle East. From 2023 to 2024, Tensions between Israel and Iran have remained highly volatile, marked by escalating proxy warfare and strategic maneuvers that underscore deep-seated animosity and regional rivalry. Iran's nuclear program has remained a focal point of tension, with Israel and its allies expressing concerns over Iran's potential to develop nuclear weapons. In response to perceived threats, Iran has engaged in military drills and showcased new defense capabilities, signaling readiness to confront any direct military actions. Its influence in regional politics has grown, further complicating the geopolitical landscape and heightening the risk of broader regional conflict. The direct air assault on the Israeli-linked ship in 2024 represents a significant escalation, showcasing Iran's readiness to engage in more direct forms of confrontation. These actions have drawn international attention and raised concerns over the potential disruption of broader Middle Eastern stability. As tensions persist, diplomatic efforts and proactive defense strategies become imperative to mitigate the risk of wider conflict and uphold regional stability. That's all for now. See you later.